It's the 2K Sports pregame show. Two teams, only one ring. Welcome to the finals on 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, and Kenny the Jet Smith here to tip off the final chapter in this year's NBA story. It's game one of the finals. Hosting the series tonight in Houston, it will be the Rockets going up against the Philadelphia 76ers. 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Game one of the NBA Finals. The Philadelphia 76ers clinched the conference championship that climaxed in a game seven showdown. But now they need four more wins to reach their ultimate goal. It all starts right here, right now, against the Rockets. The pinnacle of the postseason. The NBA Finals is here. Basketball's biggest stage, the NBA Finals. It begins here, and 2K Sports is happy to bring it to you. This is Kevin Harlan. We've got Chris Weber and Greg Anthony with us, and from the sideline, we'll be hearing from David Aldridge. Houston Rockets here at home, and an interconference matchup should be a good one. The story here, Markel Fultz injured and unable to play. Kevin, his injury is going to cost him a few games in the playoffs, that could be devastating. Now a look at Philadelphia's starting lineup. Redick and Covington make up the perimeter. The young stars, Simmons and Embiid at the four and five. And it's Evans in at the one spot. Now here's Covington. The dish to Simmons over Bosch. Simmons missing again. And so here is Houston. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Well, Kevin, I got a chance to talk to Brett Brown. We talked about game one and what it would mean for them to win it on the road. He told me we're up against the best our conference has to offer. It would be a huge victory for us. But more important than that, they realize that we're going to fight them every step of the way in this series. Well, looks like this is going to be a tough one. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, David. Huffington shot is off. And here are the Rockets now. Parsons dishes to Hart. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touched by Harden. The 76ers have gone 0 of 3 from the field to start the game. Reddick passes to Simmons. Embiid the screen. Feeds it to Covington. Philadelphia moving the ball around. Embiid sets the pick for Evans. Over DJ. Simmons. The shot comes out. Some solid defense from Bosch. Philadelphia on deep. And Parsons kicks to DJ. From 18 feet away, good on the bucket. DJ's got the scoreboard going with his first points of the night for the Rockets. See DJ shoot from the mid range, doing his best to keep this part of the court alive. It's not just all about layups and three. Embiid with a screen on Parsons, stolen by Bosch. 
And it's the Rockets on the break. Got a hand on it. They recover it. The feed now to DJ. Releases from the wing and drills it. And DJ has a reliable jump. He gets his feet set, takes his time, and rises. And B, the screen. Pass to Covington. He feeds it to Simmons. Over Bosch. The 76ers with another miss. Everything he is throwing up has been off. He needs to find his groove. And then soon. And Parsons kicks to DJ. Shot off the screen. Capella with the bucket. Capella's got his first pass. And Capella is very efficient down deep, using his muscle to get off the shots he wants inside. Now here's Evans. Guarded closer. They set the pick. Here's Simmons, and he sinks the shot coming off the strong pick. Solid pick to create that opening. The soft touch on the jump. Harden dishes to DJ. Parsons passes to DJ. That's in, coming off the assist from Parsons. And that's now seven points for DJ. Oh, when DJ is dialing it in from deep, it makes the team very dangerous. You gotta love seeing him train. And Simmons kicks to Reddick. Back to Simmons. He dishes it to Embiid. Up top, Simmons. Embiid with a screen on Hart. Lock it four. Reddick. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. Oh, he took a terrific angle right there off the screen. Something they work on every day in practice. Reddick against Harden. Oh, that's straight out of Harden's playbook. Go on the attack, drive the lane, force the defense into foul. The Rockets shooting their first foul shots of the night here. Harden hits them both. Oh, he's not making any mistakes up there today. Another solid trip to the line for him. And the foul called on DJ. That's his first foul. Now here's Evans. No scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Redick with the bucket. How on earth did they let him get that wide open? DJ. Tight defense on him. Basket is good, and he'll get a chance for one more at the free throw line. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they shot the basketball. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. It's easy to admire the heart DJ plays with. He continues to add new wrinkles to his game over time. Now here's Evans. D right on him. Simmons dishes to Evans. Yeah, easy call. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. And he knocks down the first one. Good on both. Rockets leading by five. DJ with it. Ten points for him. And Harden wide open. He shoots. Misses the three. Reddick for three. And they call over the back here. Too much contact. And that's already a second foul. He may have to spend some time on the bench to stay out of early foul. And Philadelphia making a change here. Monroe's checked in. The kick out to Bosch. Hits the three-point bomb. Well, I like how DJ actively looks for the open teammate. Whipping the ball over beautifully and quickly. The 76ers trail by eight. In the corner, Simmons with it. Down low. Capella sends it back. In the corner, it's DJ. That's in, coming off the assist from Parson. That's 12 points for DJ. Wow, unconscious has he been this quarter. They're riding that hot hand. And the 76ers call time here. 
And as the coaches go to the clipboard to outline their strategy during the timeout, the players getting a chance to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's key to staying fresh all the way to the final whistle. And, Kevin, it really is. And every one of these players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially uh, towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up. Rockets leading by seven. In the corner, Parsons with it. Bosch heads the pick for DJ. The layup missed. And you know what? You can't get a better screen. Frees him up beautifully, but he just fails to capitalize. <laughs> Best laid plans, right? Well, I tell you right there, though, that's one they'll take every single time. And no doubt, they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does, Greg. Now, here's DJ. 12 points for him. And stolen by Simmons. Oh, the lob for Simmons. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. And how about the connection Simmons has with his guys? Once the lob is on its way, you know know who's going to finish in style. Great way to see the alley-oop at replay courtesy of Under Armour. Another Unleash Chaos moment. Well, he's been the safety valve for them on every session. So dependent. Monroe outside. It's Reddick on the wing. Screened by Monroe. Shot clock at six. Excellent use of the screen that time. And that's ten points for J.J. Redick. Oh, man, that makes four or five shots. He really has gotten off to a terrific start in this first quarter. Took him no time at all on that one. And the Rockets lead by six. We'll give D.J. some credit. He's extremely efficient. He knows where his spots are. Monroe, the pass to Simmons. It goes. That's four made from the field. He's four of eight. And they've scored several times already here in the first quarter on the inside. And Parsons kicks to DJ. No oh, good with the triple. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. Here's Simmons. He's got eight. It's Evans, top of the key. Oh, the lob for Simmons. Up high to stuff the alley-oop. Absolutely the prettiest play in basketball executed to perfection. I don't think you'd get an argument there. Everybody loves the alley-oop. Oh, man, and the 6'10 frame of Capella. I mean, when it's close inside, he's a huge threat to put the ball in the bucket. For the Rockets, Nene, he's checked in for Bosch. Gordon comes in for Chandler Parsons. And Chris Pauls subbed in for James Harden. Philadelphia also making some changes. Charge checked in for Evan. Justin Anderson comes in for Robert Cuffington. And it's Korkmaz in for J.J. Redick. Here's Korkmaz. Back to Simmons. And Anderson has it in the corner. The basket good off the assist from Simmons. Anderson's got it all tied up now for the 76ers. Houston's gone three of five from three-point land so far in the ballgame. Gordon kicks to Paul. Now here's DJ. Defense right on him. And DJ throws it down. Oh, well, DJ is a smart player, a guy you can trust in the pick and roll. Once he gets a little room to shoot, he's golden. And the foul called on DJ. That's foul number two for him. Rockets leading by five. Taking a look at the 76ers. Redick and Covington make up the perimeter. Monroe is out there with Joel Embiid. And it's Evans and it's... Oh, you see that? Wow. DJ has a dunk contest written all over him. His vertical is just downright nasty. All right, let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Alder. Well, DJ in the last matchup against the Warriors was superb. He had an incredible number of points and seemed to be playing in slow motion with a huge number of assists. His numbers were off the charts. He was unguardable, and he knew it. He took advantage of it. Devin, back to you. All right, David, thank you, guys. Could you believe that performance? Whoa! Whoa! 
Gotta appreciate watching DJ shred the D on the drive, blasting around anyone who tries to stop him on termination. Evans against Harden. Here's Embiid, and a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. And this is his second trip to the line in the game. The free throw drops for Embiid. Well, after getting to the stripe in the first quarter, he's definitely been more assertive driving inside. And MB drops them both. Rockets leading by six. <laughs> Fouled in the act of shooting. A three-point play chance coming up. No clue how he got that one to fall. And the free throw, no good. The 76ers have gone three of eight from the field since the beginning of the second quarter. The 76ers again can't hit it. Look, they cannot leave him open like that. The D got away with one there. And it's Capella missing. The 76ers trail by eight. And here's Covington. He's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Evans kicks to Monroe. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. That's on Clint Capella. The 76ers have gone 9 of 13 from the line. And the second free throw, good. Houston's gone 3 of 7 tonight from three-point territory. DJ dishes to Hart. is right there. Money from the wing. DJ's got 25 points in the game. And I love the momentum he's building. Last game, he, he was just as dominant. And defensively, you know he's feeling good right now. And, and as the opposing team, you better adjust your scheme accordingly. Fires the three. That's in. Coming off the assist from Parsons. Parsons got three assists now in this one. The 76ers trail by 12. And stolen by DJ. And here we go. Fast break. DJ's got it. Cans it from downtown. DJ's got a couple of three-pointers in the second for the Rockets. Yeah, these defenders had better start closing down on shooters. Embiid sets the pick for Evans. The pass to Monroe. To the inside, Embiid. Plays it up and banks it in. Embiid's got seven. Uh, he just looks more engaged this second quarter. A far cry from his disappointing play in the first period. Now here's Evans. He's guarded closely. To the middle. Shoots from eight. They double him with DJ. Out of bounds, Houston takes possession. Here are the NBA's top scorers during this postseason as shown on the 2K leaderboard. DJ number one. And the Rockets with possession here. Dishes to Bosch. Parsons on the wing. Houston moving it around. DJ passes to Capella. I mean, and Capella really using his massive shoulders to draw contact. Not afraid to go right up into the grill of the defender. He's made one and missed one so far in the game. No good on the second, so he hits one of two. The 76ers trail by 14. Here's Redick. Not enough on that one as it misses. Something affected him on that shot, and it wasn't the defense. Here's Harden. Philadelphia grabs the miss. Embiid's got six rebounds in the game. 4-3, Covington. A three-pointer is right on target. Covington's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Harden kicks to DJ. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Harden's got four assists in the game. Philadelphia's gotten into trouble with the three ball in the second only hitting one of five attempts. And the 76ers call time here. DJ really making a difference here. Look, they can't leave him alone for a second on the perimeter. Not the way he's shooting the three. Now 
now Evans. Six points for him. Screened by Monroe. The shot by Reddick, no good. Well, it appears as though he has lost his touch a little after connecting on two in the first quarter. And he comes up with the deuce. The assist totals, Kevin, just continue to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement has been flawless. Evans kicks to Covington. Monroe sets a screen for Covington to the paint, and it's sent back by Bosch. From D. Harden. Again, the miss by Harden. The 76ers trail by 16. Tipped away. Here's Monroe. Again, Monroe missing. Houston's gone 6 of 11 when they've taken the three-point shot tonight. Very respectable. Carson shot is off. Philadelphia's gotten a lot of looks from outside tonight. 5 of 12. Covington dishes to Evans. He kicked it to Monroe. Back to Evans. There's a screen. Passes it to Covington. Just five on the clock. And Monroe with the basket on the assist from Covington. I mean, this D is a joke. It's way too passive. They got to get a body on him. He's on his way to the bucket. Now, here's DJ. He's tightly guarded. The kick out to Bosch. And the rejection by Embiid. 141 left to play in the first half. Embiid the screen. Evans kicks to Monroe. Back to Evans. Monroe sets a screen for Evans. The shot that time, not on target. Nice D from DJ. Here's Harden. And Harden with the stuff. And Harden loves getting contact on his shots. Showing off his true muscle and level of concentration. The 76ers trail by 16. Evans kicks to Monroe. And Capella over to help. Reddick against Harden. Screen by Monroe. The shot by Reddick, no good. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Nobody near Parson. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Harden's got assist number five here tonight. Philadelphia shooting here about 46% for the game. Evans kicks to MB. And MB throws it down. Good movement there. And the lead pass was right where it needed to be. Rockets leading by 17. Ring shot on the way. Rebounded by Greg Monroe. Philadelphia with the ball. And Reddick kicks to Evans. Not watching the line there. That'll be a backcourt violation. All you have to do is point to their turnovers this quarter. There's a reason the scoreboard looks like it does. Gordon checked in for Chris Bosch. And Philadelphia also making a switch. Charge checked in for Joel Embiid. And that one is good from DJ. They're, they're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five baskets are from three-point range. Evans outside. Kicks it to Monroe. Back to Evans. All sorts of time. And that's good. Number two. Evans has got eight. Here's DJ. 37 points for him. Harden left side. Takes the three. And another three for Houston. Oh, and that catch and shoot Jay from Harden is unblockable. Just quickly shooting off the pad. And he drains the three but let's see they may need to review it I'm not sure the ball was out of his hand in time and we are not going to have time just yet officials signaling they are going to review the tape and, and listen in a critical moment this is the NBA finals the officials have to be 110 percent certain they've got the call right and they're keeping the call is thank you David and we'll be back for the third quarter of action following halftime Welcome back to our presentation of the NBA Finals as we get going again. A look at DJ in this one. He's been everywhere. And through the first two quarters, he was dynamite from beyond. Yeah, I'm surprised the defense didn't do a better job of adjusting. I mean, extending out on him a little bit more. On either wing, Harden and Parsons. 
Clint Capella is out there with Chris Bosch, and it's DJ, and they're the group for Mike D'Antoni starting the second half. Pardon? That's good. 12 straight points off of three pointers, and the D looks chips. And Simmons kicks to MB. And the shot goes in. He's got 11. And defensively, th this is the opposite of how you want to start the second half. Yeah, I mean, you spend all that time in the locker room trying to get mentally prepared. Then you come out and give up that. No. And he gets it back. Capella with the bucket. The 76ers shooting well. 50% from the floor. Simmons with it. And guarded by Capella. To the middle. And stolen by Simmons. Evans left side. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. What mastery from Simmons. Fooling the entire defense in the paint there. For Philadelphia, they have had 15 tries at the line. They've made 10. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. And if you're just joining us, we played over a minute here in the third. Bosch passes to Harden. Houston moving it around. DJ dishes to Bosch. And then Bosch with the jam. And, and being that Bosch is 6'11, dunking comes easy. And, and once he's this close to the basket, he's ready to attack. They set the pick. Evans kicks to Covington. Six to shoot. Pass to Simmons. And it's sent back by Bosch. left to the wing and a wide open look for DJ and it's off from three point range here's Philadelphia the dish now to Evans Simmons against Bosch Simmons sets a screen for Evans back to Simmons the basket good off the assist from Evans and that's now 17 points for Ben Simmons Harden the pass to DJ Capella and it's blocked and don't forget about the long reach that Simmons possesses that he uses it exceptionally well on defense to come away with blocks like that Covington kicks to Simmons and no good that time and the Rockets take it the other way feeds it to DJ another miss by Houston for Philadelphia, they've gone two of four here to start the second half. Back to Simmons. Here's Embiid. And the rebound goes to the Rockets. I'm sure he'd say to himself, no excuse for missing that shot, even when it's such a clean look. Another shot. Rebounded by Covington. Covington's got four rebounds in this game. Well, uh, you know, they're in the lead, but he's still been frustrated from an offensive standpoint. Back to Evans. It's rebounded by Houston. Capella's got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. But Trey, they get it back. And the shot is good. Oh, man, Capella absolutely destroys the The 76ers have gone 6 of 10 from the field in the third quarter. Simmons passes to Holmes. Back to Simmons. There's a screen. Holmes, that's a screen. Shoots from 12. And it's DJ with the rebound. And for Houston, they're shooting around 44% in this third quarter. And the basket by Gordon. Continuing to push the action and build this lead. And you see he's not worried about what's on the scoreboard. He just wants to go ham each possession. And the officials signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. Well, he recorded just one turnover in the first, but since then, he hasn't been as effective holding on to the ball. Monroe's check in for Philadelphia. Now the feed to Paul. Has 
the DJ. From deep three-point range, and no good. Simmons with the defensive effort. He, well, he hasn't been very precise at all this point. Another miss by Philadelphia. Rocket shooting a smooth 58% from the field. Everything going according to plan for them on that end. Gordon dishes to DJ. Gordon kicks to DJ. Let's it go from the wing. And that one is off. And Philadelphia the other way now. Here's Korkmaz. He feeds it to Monroe. Outside for Simmons. Lays it up, and despite of the excellent defense at that, Simmons got 21 in the game. I just love the heart of Simmons. It doesn't matter what the D throws his way. He's going to nail the shot. The, the defense has just been unable to slow him down. Wow, what a game. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. And Sharich kicks to Monroe. Unloads from nine. And two shots coming up at the line as he gets fouled on the shot. And there's the foul against Houston. And, and what patience from Simmons on offense. So skilled at making the D feel nervous when he has to rock. These guys have had some good motion on offense. Nice assistant. And, and when everyone's involved offensively, it has a way of helping you on the defensive side as well. Charge up top. Reza covering. The pass to Korkmaz. Back to Sharich. His first shot coming late, and it's DJ with the rebound. DJ's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. And it's Paul missing. 76ers have gotten half their shots to drop in the second half up to this point, going 7 of 14. Outside, Simmons. Dishes it to Monroe. They double him with DJ. Here's Korkmaz. The putback controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. So what an incredible effort from Simmons. Using his length so well when he's hitting the board. Houston moving it around. And that one is good from DJ. DJ's got 42 in the game. He continues to be their go-to guy. If they close this game out, his stamp will be all over this room. On the wing, again, the miss by Sharich. The Rockets shooting around 44% in this third quarter. Shock up two there. DJ's got seven points here in this quarter. Oh, and sometimes there's just no slowing DJ down. He excels at getting his shot off in time over the defense. Dishes it to Reddick. He kicks to Monroe. Outside, Simmons. That one, no good. Some solid defense there by Nene. Paul passes to Gordon. Good, and Paul gets the assist. Gordon's got seven. How about the passing? They are moving the ball without any thought, without any individual agenda. Simmons dishes to Reddit. To end the run. And. Simmons with the layup. Simmons got 26 points. And not being as aggressive from the three-point line anymore. They had a lot more attempts in that first half. Look at the intensity of Nene. One of the strongest guys in the game. Phenomenal at scoring the ball inside. Passes it to Korkmaz. 30 seconds left to play here in the third. That one good for two. That's 28 points for Ben Simmons. Oh, this guy, his motor is always the same. No matter what the score of the game is, he always remains aggressive. Let's go. Will not go. This is off the front eye. Fires from 18. Monroe. The second effort. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. It's on Nene. And the athleticism that Simmons has is downright unreal. Just a remarkable talent 
who has the potential to be one of the all-time greats. Eight seconds left in the third quarter. Now, here's DJ. An amazing shot just barely oh! beat the buzzer! That is as big a shot as you are ever oh! going to see. Nice shot, incredible clutch performance, putting the team on his back and taking them right across the finish line. And as we conclude the third quarter, pretty much a blowout. It's been a one-sided affair. The Rockets on top, running away with it. We're going to step aside for just a second, but join us right back here for the start of the fourth quarter next. <laughs> We welcome you back to our presentation of Game 1. Philadelphia shooting at 48% from the floor. Looking good. On the court for Philadelphia to start the fourth. Robert Covington out there with Dario Saric. Then there's Blunt. Then it's Greg Monroe. And it's Vaughn in at the two. Blunt can't get it to go. It's a confidence shaker when you can't hit a wide open three like that. Stolen by Monroe. Here's Blunt. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. It's on Chris Bosch. And one of the problems in the first half, that shoddy work at the free throw line. They needed to fix that, and they've been much improved since the break. And they are making it look easy at the free throw line here in the second half. Anderson, he's checked in for Philadelphia. Rocket shooting has been outstanding in this game at 58%. Well, the defense had nothing to do with that turnover. They're just fortunate. That's just plain sloppy pass. Here's Philadelphia. Here's Blunt. Kicks it to Sharnish. Pass to Blunt. From the wing. That's good on the jump shot. Blunt's got four points now in the quarter. And it's the Rockets with the ball. DJ with it. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. But when DJ is on the attack, watch out. Sometimes all you can do is whack him. Hope he misses you. Terrific speed. Wells, he's checked in for Houston. Rashawn Holmes, he's checked in for the 76ers. A few possessions into the fourth quarter, just over a minute played. Doubled by Bosch. Anderson outside. Pass to Vaughn. Six on the shot clock. Holmes, that's a screen. It's deflected. DJ is solid at knowing when to leap up to block shots. Got to be careful with shooting when he's around. And there's the whistle on the shot. Took the foul. Shot misses. He'll be shooting two. He's off on the first. And the Rockets making a change here. Barton has checked in. And he sinks the second. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth quarter. Now the dish to Monroe. And he drops it in from the low post. I love how he establishes his post position inside before he converts. From deep. And DJ gets it to go on the assist from Wells. DJ's got 51. Up top, Holmes. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Holmes, that's a screen. Shoots a three. Out of bounds. Houston takes possession. This has been a one-sided affair. Yeah, they've done a nice job of extending their lead and maintaining that intensity level. Barton kicks to DJ. Down to five on the shot clock. Houston needs to get a shot. 
And again, it's the Rockets from deep. And really, as the three-pointers keep dropping, you get the sense that the frustration is mounting for the defense. Here's Blunt. Out to the wing. Left block shot on the way. Monroe. He's off on that one. Some solid defense from Bach. And the shots just continue to say no in terms of falling. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Monroe with a screen on Barton. A nice shot by Anderson. And that's what you give up when you don't fight over the screen. A lot of times your defense is your offense. Your offense is your defense. This is poor decision right here. You can't let them have that shot. Also might have been a lack of effort. And it's Monroe, top of the key. Here's Blunt. Feeds to Monroe. Over Bosch. Again, Monroe missing. Houston's gone two or three in the fourth quarter from long range. Good shooting so far. And DJ throws it down. And DJ is tenacious on the drive. Exceptional at getting speed behind him. They saw him for the slam. One passes to Monroe. And it's out of bounds. The 76ers able to retain possession here. Man, you love the effort. Just getting the hand in there and knocking it out. Well, some of that, too, is just setting the tone by being aggressive. You need guys like this on your team. Clint Capella, he's checked in for Chris Bosch. Embiid, he's checked in for the 76ers. Wells in the corner. Over Vaughn. Rebounded by Holmes. Philadelphia has gotten just one of four three-pointers to go down for them here in the fourth. And Anderson kicks to MB. Here's Vaughn. Back to Embiid. And it's in. Basket number six for him thus far. He has only missed two shots from the floor. There's no lack of aggression on his part. He's got the chance to score. He'll take it. And it's DJ missing. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. Anderson dishes to Embiid. Wells grabs the miss. Rockets have gone four of seven for the field since the beginning of the fourth. From downtown, and DJ gets it to go on the assist by Wells. Wells has got his seventh assist here tonight. Here's Blunt. The pass to Holmes. Here's Blunt. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. First one falls for. The Rockets making a switch here. Onuaku's checked in. So he gets them both. Here's DJ. Wells kicks to DJ. And again, it's the Rockets from deep. <laughs> I mean... What else can you do against him? The 76 are shooting a pedestrian 36% in the fourth quarter. The offense not doing their best work of late. Passes it to Vaughn. Capella against Embiid. Here's Blunt. The 76 ers with another miss. He doesn't look like himself right now. Nothing is going right. Barton against Anderson. DJ kicks to well. Shoots. And it's DJ missing. Philadelphia shooting reasonably well, 45%. Here's Blunt. The Rockets pull it in. He is just really almost playing for the other team. The shooting has just been poor. Now here's DJ. Tight defense on him. And DJ throws it down. Look at the energy of DJ. Watching him sky high for the slam. He's just a terrific athlete. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively for sure. 
Here's Blunt. Cam's the tough leaner from the outside. Blunt's got eight points here in this quarter. How about the leaner? Only the guys with the sweetest of strokes can pull that off in traffic. Now here's DJ. He's covered closely. It's Barton on the wing. There's the feed to DJ. Shot clock at six. Pass to Onoaku. He pulls off the Houdini to make that catch and slam it through. Stupendous alley-oop. It was beautiful the first time, but Under Armour showing us the replay of that tremendous alley-oop again. Another unleash chaos moment. Wells with the steal. How on the play, basket down, so it'll be a three-point play chance. Yeah, you gotta respect the strength of Wells. Terrific at powering through the foul and finishing on those hard shots. So for the Rockets, Nene, he's checked in for Clint Capella. And Trevor Ariza has subbed in for Will Barton. And then for Philadelphia, Corkmaz checked in for Vaughn. And it's Evans in for Blunt. DJ passes to Nene. He feeds it to DJ. Who's back up? And Philadelphia grabs the miss. Anderson's got three rebounds now in this one. To the middle. He's looking for Embiid and finds him. Second shot opportunity. Yes, that goes in. He's one of the guys having a solid game for them, but as a whole, they've been lacking. Houston's gone 4-6 from beyond the arc in the fourth quarter so far. Evans outside. Pass to Cork. Mines. Let's it go from 11. A second chance effort. Holmes can't get it to go in. Not the tightest of D on the back, but not the best of finishes either. Stolen by Anderson. Evans outside. Back to Anderson. He dishes it to Embiid. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. Embiid's got 10 points in just the second half. Rocket shooting it brilliantly here lately. 60% from the field. Now, here's DJ. Defense is right there. To the left wing. Here's Wells. It's good from long range. And certainly, they are not hesitating, letting it fly from deep here in the second half. Evans outside. Dishes it to Anderson. Over a reason. Anderson can't get it to go. So far, we've seen them be a bit careless with the ball. Simply put, out of control is how they play thus far. They're going to have to reel it in and show some more discipline. Philadelphia has gone into a funk from downtown in the fourth. Only one of their five three-pointers has found the bottom of the bucket. Embiid the screen. Evans dishes to Embiid. Taken away by Nene. Ariza right side. Odoaku kicks to DJ. One forty-one left to play here in the fourth. And that kind of sums up the defensive effort we've seen here tonight, guys. The 76 is shooting only 35% in the fourth quarter. The offense looking a little rickety. Holmes has a screen. And the foul called on DJ. That's his third foul of the game. Eric Gordon, he's checked in for Wells. The 76 is also with a sub. Monroe's checked in. 132 left in the fourth quarter. Holmes has a screen. Ariza against Anderson. Pocket six. The 
76ers with another miss. And guys, you can go ahead and put game one in the record books. Exactly how they wanted to kick off this series against a tremendous opponent. Big win for Houston. Look at their number of assists. You know, they didn't get stuck in those one-on-one -on -one situations, and, and they got the ball to the guys with the best matchups. Easy drives, open jumpers, and great ball movement. And you know, looking back in all the contributions tonight, it was a really phenomenal all-around game for DJ. And the way he was able to dice up their D with his passing really made things easy for everyone else on his team. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. Oh, the intensity from DJ. He's superb at rising up and getting the D to foul him when he's looking to shoot. Chris Bosch has checked in for the Rockets. And both free throws good for DJ. Anderson outside. It's Monroe, high post. Now the pass to Korkmaz. Evans kicks to home. Philadelphia moving the ball around. Shot to end this cold run. Chris Bosch with the rebound. DJ with it. Evans is there. Ariza kicks to DJ. Count the basket. And given the fans what they came to see, a, a spirited performance. Yeah, with a double-digit lead at this point, they could pretty much mark this one up in the win column. So we see the Rockets taking the win here. A uh, pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You know, Kevin, momentum. Fantastic game. Thanks. Listen.